Well, just like in Louisiana, forestry is a huge part of the economy in Chile. Recent years have seen an increase in its value. As this week in Louisiana Agriculture's Neil Melanson shows us, even though the trees and the harvesting methods are different, business there affects us here in the U.S. This eucalyptus stand isn't a forest, it's a field of crops. That's the way many Chilean farmers see it, and however you call it, it's part of a growing economy in South America that provides pulpwood products to the world. In fact, Chile is the second largest supplier of hardwood chips behind Vietnam and accounts for two-thirds of all shipment of chips from South America as a whole. However, behind the numbers is a growing multinational industry that is driving this nation's economy, much like forestry drives Louisiana. The trees were 14 years old when they were harvested, and they were harvested, uh, that the yield was about 240 tons to, to the acre. Some of our better pine plantations that I've managed were uh, at a age 15, which is very comparable to the 14 year age, were about 90 to 100 tons to the acre. So over twice as much in the eucalyptus, that's, that's high yield. The emphasis on forestry products in Chile right now is on pulp and pulpwood products, which means a change from pine stands to eucalyptus stands, and that really plays into the strengths of the eucalyptus and their fast-growing lifespan. Eucalyptus is a native Australian tree, but is well suited for Chile's dry climate. From start to finish, the trees grow from seedling to maturity in 15 years versus the 18 years and more for pine and hardwoods in the U.S. Blanchard said he has an experimental stand of eucalyptus back home in an effort to capitalize on the South American success, but so far, the climate of Louisiana hinders his efforts. That's their overall guiding objective, and the bottom line is to make money and do that by decreasing the cost and increasing the yield. Is, that's what these guys are trying to do. From Los Angeles, Chile, I'm Neil Melanson for This Week in Louisiana Agriculture. While Chile is the second largest exporter of eucalyptus, growers there face plenty of competition from Brazil and other South American countries. The Chilean government also has enacted regulations to protect the country's endangered forests, which is also limiting expansion of current eucalyptus harvesting operations.